One of the cool tools in Office 2010 is the use of smart art. It is a powerful feature and you can enable it and utilize it by going to insert and then smart art. Smart art expresses or allows us to utilize a graphic to visually communicate information. Smart art graphics range from graphical lists to processes and diagrams to organizational charts. So for example, let's uh, say that if we wanted to traditionally what we would do to define, for example, the process of continuous improvement on quality standards, we'd probably have these terms, define, analyze, solve, implement, and review. And we'll just write them down in our document. However, with Office 2010, and this was also available in 2007, you can utilize SmartArt, and you basically just click on SmartArt, and then you choose one of those diagrams from here. So in our case, probably process here or a cycle would probably work best. So we can pick any of those at this point and then click OK. Now notice we have this option here on the left where we can type the text. So if we wanted to put those words in there, we could say define. It's the first one. And then so basically just typing the text. We can close this, by the way, to show it and hide it. It's basically this little icon or little triangle here. And notice this is much more visual, much easier and better to, you, to use. So now, once we have the smart art graphic here, by the way, you could remove something, you could add something, and it gets uh, re it readjusts automatically. So if I wanted to delete one of those, it resizes automatically. Or if I want to add it again, then it readjusts everything. Notice that the contextual tools again are available for this. So as soon as we click on the uh, smart art, we have two tabs here. We have the design tab and the format tab. Under the design tab, we can change the colors for this design, make it more colorful. You can choose different styles for this uh, design as well by choosing one of those styles from here. And if you do not like this design, this layout, you can pick a different one from here. And notice it adjusts automatically. So this is a better uh, visual representation rather than having a bunch of text on your document. You'd have a graphic to illustrate the concept and it's more meaningful.